13th, uh, we have a football game that's senior night that starts at 7 o'clock. October 18th, there's a band concert in the DCHS Little Theater at 7 p.m. October 19th, we have the DCES Talent Show. This is from 6.30 until 8.30 p.m. at the DCES Gym. October 23rd through 27th, we've got October break, so that's coming up right around the corner here. Um, November 10th, 11th, and 12th is the DCHS Musical. It's titled Mean Girls, DCHS Little Theater at 7 p.m. and 7 p.m. and also 2 p.m. on those dates. Uh, November 13th, we have our regular scheduled board meeting here in the DCMS Abbey and Libby Memorial Library at 7 p.m. Uh, at this point, we're going to move forward to some board comments. Uh, Mr. Schwarzkopf. Yeah, uh, I'd like to thank everybody that has attended tonight, and whether you're in person or on Zoom, I uh, appreciate that. Uh, a thank you to Ross. I'll, I'll get started off. Um, many years uh, and he's served the corporation in many different facets. It uh, was here at the beginning of some building of the, the Ag Wing and and with him and Beth took our Ag uh, department to a whole new level and um, as a become kind of an administrator and what he's done with transportation you don't get a lot of people I'll jump on the bus and because there's nobody else to drive he does his job plus that um, his uh, heart for the kids shows out every day. Um, DCTA and the Pumpkins, thank you very much. Uh, I guess maybe Mr. Connor's not here. Um, and we'll thank him uh, in person that. Uh, thank you for uh, for the potential of the portable stairs uh, into the water. It's it's we're always glad when we can help the community, and then as a, as giving back, we appreciate that just as much too. So. Appreciate that. Um, good luck to our sports uh, for their sectionals and stuff. Uh, high hopes for uh, everybody, and you never know when it comes sectional to uh, what can be accomplished. Um, the other last thing I'll say is uh, get out and see our band, our talent show uh, that's being put on, and our musicals. Um, sometimes they don't get enough. Um, um, Raw, raw, I'll say, and they do well deserve it because there's as much goes in a practice and a band member, or whether it's musical and these little kids and their talent shows, um, you just got to love it. And so please um, make it so we have to turn people away. All right, we'll, we'll talk that way. Want to beat you, Mr. Priest. It's hard to believe the school year is one fourth of the way over already. The first nine weeks went fast. Me. I heard a good report on the uh, fire prevention show in the elementary, so whoever is responsible for that, thank you. Good luck to all the high school students this Wednesday when you take your PSAT test. Uh, good luck. And thank you to all the teachers that have to supervise and take care of that. That works appreciated. Uh, thank you, Mr. Long, for all the work you did on the school safety manual. I thought the AI grant information was very interesting, and it sounded like uh, we were lucky to get the grant. And about Ross, I know he said he was going to retire, but I did notice on his retirement letter he volunteered to as a substitute driver, so that was yeah. appreciated. <laughs> Mr. Strasser. Uh, I'll keep it short and uh, echo my fellow board members' comments, um, but pick out Ross specifically for all the years that he spent here, and hopefully he doesn't lose his license driving around. <laughs> 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 all right, well, I'd like to thank everyone for attending tonight's meeting and also uh, at climate report or that climate survey that kind of intrigues me on I'm interested to, to hear some results on how that goes uh, maybe not so I, I'm hoping the kids are feeling safe but I, I'm, I'm more concerned on how the parents are going to hopefully they'll uh, participate in this this survey also and uh, I'd also like to thank Ross for his years of service he's 
been a great asset, and he's uh, he's Mr. Delphi Community School Corporation to a lot of people. So uh, I wish him all the best in his retirement. And I know he won't stay away, so because he he loves the kids so much. So I I know we'll see him around. So just want to congratulate him on a great career. And all the best to him. So many years is it for Ross? Forty some. Forty three. I had a forty year a forty year class reunion this year, and he was here when I left uh, <laughs> some years ago. Wow. So uh, I believe he's the last official person that's held out for uh, during my tenure as a high school student. Uh, but he left. You know, he was a bigger in life person when he was a teacher, uh, and you know, so he leaves big big shoes everywhere he goes, and so we really do appreciate Ross and his contributions through all the years to the corporation and the, the number of students and uh, activities he's been a part of is just incredible. Uh, so I think everybody that's here tonight as well, uh, so much uh, work goes on behind the scenes and uh, to all the administrators and uh, staff and everything that everybody does all the time, I, I don't think we ever think about the number of hours that go into their jobs outside of the school day because school day is filled with students. And so I just want to say thanks to everybody that, for everything they do all the time. So uh, the climate survey piece, that's it. that is an exciting thing to figure out. I, you know, we think we have safe schools, but how do the kids feel? How do the parents feel? Uh, and I think that's a different answer than what we believe is, is actually happened. So thank you for, for working on that. That'll be real interesting. And congratulations to the new soccer coach. <laughs> I think you'll be great. <laughs> Excited to have you on board. And that's it for today. All right, Mr. Mayor. Um, well, I too will uh, thank Ross for all his many, many years of service and the many, many, many hats that he wore for our school corporation for many, many years. So, uh, secondly, I, I do want to thank Josh Long for the, all the work he's done on the as the safety director or coordinator, whatever you want to call him. That was much needed work that needed to be done. Um, thank you to and Chip and uh, our maintenance director on coming up with a plan for a position that I think we sorely needed. Uh, I look forward to hopefully we can find the best person possible for that job. And they can share the uh, shoes that uh, Troy Schrader wore for so many years here at Delphi and did right. such a great job for us. Um, everybody have a great fall break. And lastly, if anyone knows anyone on the dance team, I would probably take some of those beef house rolls. <laughs> <laughs> We're still practicing, so you may catch me. If you go to see them at sectionals, you can get some down the coming to me. Not frozen, they'll be fresh. <laughs> I know we talked about putting a TV up there to help the kids with the current events that's going on. Because if you know, a lot of kids are stuck to their phones and they're not watching the news, they're hearing it through social media. So we want to try to implement that in there and then we want to make it more for like a college life up there. High, school's, high school and junior and senior year are supposed to prepare your kids for college, so we're going to try to make it more like a college setting up there. And um, you'd be surprised how many high school students don't know what a resume is. So we're trying to implement those things in there too about getting resume, applying for scholarships, and making the next steps for college. So. Sorry about the interactions, okay. the interruptions here. <laughs> <laughs> you have a so you don't throw people off. Yeah. 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 No. So, all right. Thank you. If, if I could comment on resume, Ross, I've been And I wasn't sure what he what Ross did, not because he didn't do anything, but because his hand was in just about everything. everything and yeah. It took me about four or five years to figure out his title. So I, I wish him good luck in his retirement. Well, he does not want anything for his retirement. Can I just point this out? I have this feeling he's surprised. Going to yes. Yeah. Okay. So uh, yeah, I mean, I, I think Ross could be the title or you know, the topic here tonight. Just. Uh, 
I, th I didn't know Gil was going to top me out. I mean, I was here 20 years ago, I, I guess. Yes, I got you by a couple. <laughs> yeah, but, you know, I mean, it is what it is. But uh, I do think they're, we're going to need a pretty big basket for the hats that he's going to take off when he walks out the door. So, um, obviously, we're trying to make sure we can lighten the load for people coming into that spot. So, that's exciting. Uh, the technology piece that we heard about tonight, obviously the AI and the, the bus, uh, the new software for the buses, that's just very exciting to know that we can, we're really starting to get, be able to use technology to save us some money, to, to be better, to get these kids a better route on the bus, to get them to know that what buses they're supposed to be on, and that's a huge help. So uh, thank you to everyone, obviously, administrators and everybody involved in all of the uh, topics tonight, whether it's safety, um, you know, it's the, the playground, the fences, any of that. That's all exciting to know that we're moving forward and we feel good about it. Um, the climate survey was a little more interesting than I originally thought it was going to be because I was the one that thought we were doing a survey to find out if we had hot and cold classrooms. So after I read through it, I was. So in all reality, I thought we were worried about heating and cooling uh, kids. So uh, she, I, I, I'll raise my hand on that one. I would, uh, maybe title it differently next time. I don't know. But uh, it is exciting because the uh, I don't think we tend to ask kids a lot about how they feel. We just assume how they feel, uh, and that's probably what, as an adult, our biggest problem is to assume what they think rather than what they really do. So. Um, with that, I'm going to ask for one more motion, and that's for adjournment. I move we adjourn. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I may. I mean, she sent me the board packet. That's an extra one. Okay. That's one. Okay. It's not. Yeah. Ross. Ross is here. You did not have this.